Uh, let's make sure I think we should be alright for a little while. So, um, in we go. Uh, we're gonna go to the orbit landing pad. Uh, almost half full on cargo, but. Oh, life support. Live support. We got some up there, but life support will start suffocating the moment we hit the planet. Why is this not... Why are you not showing? Hmm. Why? I don't know why it's not showing this. Maybe it's because we're not in space yet. Space break, uh, Space exploration has had a couple of updates, so that might have changed. But that should last us a while. At least until we get to the uh, chest. Anyway. Oh, it's gone really dark. And blast off. And we survived! Woohoo! <laughs> Um, yeah, meteors fall up here, by the way, as well, so we might need to get some of those uh, cannons. But, we're now on the surface of the planet. We have, I'm um, guessing, about 2 hours and 45 minutes. Let's pick up that. Oh, now we've got 4 hours. <laughs> I think it might be a little bit overkill. Oh, we got a little bit of space pop up here. Oh, we didn't make any anyway, so it's all good. Right then. So. What to make now? First. Uh, I think third, first, if we can. I know we started with some science up here. Maybe we get science on the go? Yeah, I'm thinking so let's get science on the go. Let's grab the... Um, there was some... Um, did we not get a return rocket? Oh, we did. Thank God for that. Holy shit. I thought I... I forgot we got that. Um, I'm just going to plug you there, so don't forget that you do exist. Holy shit. I, th I thought I really gone done fucked up then. Well, there's water up here as well. We got two other capsules. We'll be taking those with us. Um, we have the rock of those cargo bits, so... Yeah. There's more around here somewhere. I swear I saw them. Oh, they're there. Yoink. Very useful. Um, but anyway, let's get the uh, space platform scaffold and just push this out a little bit. Ugh. Going to be a pain with the uh, the rock or the uh, asteroid that we're on. He's not going to like to mix. Eh, it's a little bit better. Okay, so science so we need to in either a space assembly machine or a space manufactory provide blue circuits transport belts solid rocket fuel stone and cosmic water. okay so space belts our blue motors low density structure steel plates and lubricant which we need to decant out of a barrel Okay, where was these guys? Oh, we did get a space manufacturer, that's cool. Decontamination facility, that's useful. I'm guessing when we do the mining that we get the water ice. Because then we have some there. Right. 
Anywho. Oh, and uh, while I can, before I completely forget, I want to make sure we are accumulating some power. Now, the good thing is this um, radar construction beacon uh, it distributes electrical energy, um, extends construction area, provides radar, uh, vision. It's got 64 tile connection ranges. Pretty damn hot. Which is cool, because um, if we're not using power, it'll allow our accumulators to pick some up, or it should do. Yeah, fully charged. Um, and when it needs power, it'll just distribute it. So, uh, let's go for you there. And I want to get all of the lubricant barrels. So we can start decanting this. Uh, did I bring any tanks? No. Do we have any tanks? We have two. That will be something we'll be doing next time we come up. And oh yeah, we need pipe. So I'm going to create a handful of uh, undergrounds, even though we don't necessarily need them at the minute. Cool, and uh, we need an output for the barrels. Okie dokie then. So, next up we'll get space belts going. So, you require blue motors, LDS, and steel plate. And yet, yeah, most of this is going to be handball. Until we can figure out, um, well, expand this and then figure out a nicer way of doing some movement around here. I just want to get things going so we can plod along. So, steel, uh, LDS is around here somewhere. I know I saw them. And what was it again? Blue bows. So, blue motors, LDS, steel, you can output to here, thanking you very much. Uh, now for the cosmic water, so that's lubricant and, one lubricant and 99 water. Okay, so we're going to have to set up another, like, decanting area. We've got a chunk of water barrels. Anything down here useful? Nope. But we don't have any tanks. Eee. The pipes have got some storage in them, so they'll do for a minute. Uh, let's go... You and you. You're going to unload. Oh, that's filled, so that's empty. And what do we make you in? You're in a decontamination. So, did I pick that up? No. Oh, you're a chunky boy. So, cosmic water. Uh, let's outfeed some lubricant. 
Not to there. Oh, ballers. Should have looked at that in the first place. So yeah, water there. And then lubricant there. Let's bung the water in. Uh, water that will not evaporate at low pressure, more suitable for space applications. Okay, so that is definitely a fluid. Cool. And then I think that's mostly it. Yeah. It's the belts, the cosmic water which we got, and then we just actually need to add the blue circuits, the rocket fuel, and the stone. Uh, which can be done in here, I believe. Yes. So, let's say crafting can be done in either the assembly machines or the manufactory. The thing, the main difference is obviously one, it's bigger, but two, this one can handle multiple fluids in one. And because we are handling, um, we do at times need to handle multiple fluids, it just sometimes makes sense to use it instead. Um, but, we need one fluid for this. I'm going to do this until we can get some tanks. Now we do already have some kind of space belt to hand, so we'll yoink. Uh, let's do blue. These look like stupid quick ones. Yeah, stupid quick belts. Oh, shit. And then have we got I think the massive space science lab lab. Uh there is that enough? I think it's enough. We only need three more, don't we, yeah? So remind me that's blues, rocket fuel, and stone. Stone, blues, and rocket fuel. Now, I don't think this is going to kick off straight away because it doesn't have all of the other science packs, like these ones, but we have got them over there. I'm just going to see if it does. Obviously, the other ones down back on the home world, back on the planet, do have the science packs that we need. But I'm pretty sure we have to provide it to this as well. I should have brought some speed mods as well, because these are just fucking slow. I have to maybe consider making another setup. Alright, before... Just quickly cancel that just for a second. It's not necessarily the research I want. Not first, anyway. Go faster. Right, so. Oh, you're only going to hold two. Oh, okay. Um. Place you there. Ah. Right. Now. What do I want? For the first research? Ooh, that's a good question. So this would be really good. We're not really using nuclear fuel at the moment. That's 300. That's insane. Um, I think we're going to have to go with the space um, platform scaffold. 
gonna have to be the first one done. Because without that, we're not gonna be able to expand too quickly up here. So this is gonna be our first research. Now, will it go? No, it won't. So yeah, we do have to borrow the other research, uh, the other science packs. Okay, that's fine. So it's a really good job that I did stockpile uh, all of the science packs down, at the, down on the planet. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, you go for it quite quick. Uh, can I get you to do that a lot faster? Holy shit, you're fast. Yeah, we could bring up military ones if we wanted to. But I don't necessarily think there's going to be a much of a need for that at the minute. Yeah, you burnt through that really quick. Okay, that's fine. That is very fine. I'm going to steal these barrels. And can we... No, we can't fit more in there. Okay, so that's got science on the go. It's going to be slow. Yes. It's going to be very slow. Uh, I'm probably going to seriously upscale this shortly first i think it might be worth setting up or getting some delivery cannons set up now and that way then we could fire up the water we could fire up the lubricant and then shoot the uh, empty barrels back and just keep a continuous cycle going uh we're gonna need some more tanks uh some more storage tanks for fluid just so we can keep up with the lubricant Keep up with the um, storage of water so we can keep all this trying along. And then as we get this tried along, even better. Can't complain too much then. Uh, I'm thinking very quickly, though, I'm going to plop in a lot more accumulators. The sooner we have a lot more power, the better. And we're not using too much power up here, so these will fill up pretty quick. Are you... Something missing from that space. I don't know exactly what. Okay, something missing from there. Oh, okay, if you say so. Right, so we should have a lot of power now. Um, now we've got 300 megajoules storage. We're using like 5.5 megawatt right now. We're not using the, uh, the lab, so makes sense. Um, now, I did notice that we have got uh, like another construction pylon here. We've got a pylon substation. We've got a pylon. They all do essentially the same thing. So we'll be able to employ those a lot more effectively once we, uh, once we get some stuff done. Uh, I'm going to place down a... Warehouse, though. Because everything in here, I want in here. Oh. Miss on the zoom, then. Can I pick up all of the scrap? Yes. Uh... Pick up some of this useless stuff. Kind of. Clean that, so we'll take that. I'm not worried too much about the med pack. Is there anything useful we can use down the bottom? Not really. Most of this is guaranteed all space stuff. There's a couple of bits we could use. But I think... 
Fluid isothermic generator. What's that? Requires liquid fuel with an energy value, such as liquid rocket fuel, to generate electricity. Simple, compact, but lacks the energy efficiency of larger steam-based systems. Designed for space, actual fluid consumption depends on fluid fuel value. Not your boiler. Okay. That. Okay. <laughs> right. uh, let's get back down to the planet. We can organize... Uh, Excuse me. Um, organize a few bits and pieces to come back up. Might be a little while before we get to come back up, but at least we can organize some bits and pieces like tanks and other such junk. Oh, we missed the landing pad. Uh, it was the emergency burn anyway, so I, I suppose it kind of makes sense that we did. Uh, okay. I want to put barrels back in. Probably somewhere over here. A scrap, a scrap. I need to put more coal in the plastic. Uh, plastic works. So I was getting rid of some of the excess copper from the uh, um, deep core miners, just here and there. And then we started seriously running out, so I was like, okay, I'm not doing that anymore. But we can use it for scrap and turn scrap into landfill. Um, let's, uh, let's grab all that again, and top off on anything we may need. I'm also going to get rid of you, you, and you, and, oh, didn't drop those off, it's fine. So yeah, we'll probably get some delivery cannons set up, we'll craft some, um, I'll pick up the extra... Yeah, the extra things are there. It's cool. Uh, you can go in there. You can go in there. Um, I am going to put you guys in. You guys in there. Cargo rocket. Oh, you're not in, you're not feeding. Why have you got rockets? It's weird. I know it's taken out. I know it took the rockets out of the plane, but nothing else took has taken rockets out of the plane. Nothing. I don't know why. It's just really weird. All right. Let's keep some. Let's get some fuel up here. And we've got some call over to the uh, plastic works. Oh, wrong button. Um, let's take call from probably here, which is flickering like a I don't know like like I don't know what. Oh no, 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 no. Right, you can go back in there. Um, I'll probably repair that space capsule. Repair pack, 50 heat shielding, and LDS. Let's go. LDS. Up. Uh, heat shielding, sorry. LDS up here. And do we have any repair packs here? Uh, no. Well, poop. Hmm. 
could do with actually making a fair few. There you go. I'll work for a bit. Right then. So, delivery cannon. Pretty much all they do is you load them up. When they're full, they just fire whatever they contain, and then it gets received at one end. So you have got the the cannon, and you've got the cannon uh, delivery cannon chest, which is just essentially just the receiving point. And uh, there is a there they go delivery cannon cannon capsule. There's a few of those. We're gonna need a few. Right, space capsules, good. Let's get that out of the way. Uh, you. Okay, you're full. You're full now, so I can take you away and do you. Because I don't want it to keep supplying more and more and more. If I was great with like the logistics and the wiring stuff of things, I'd probably be able to go. If this is full, stop this from inserting. But I'm, I'm not that good at that. I'm not going to lie, I'm not. Okay. Delivery cannon. I'd like a couple, please. Uh, big motors, steel chests, pipe, concrete, heat shielding. Um, where be playing? I don't want to be walking around everywhere. Let's make sure I can make up a ton of the chests. Uh, I forget because I'm an idiot. Uh, heat shielding, concrete, and three movers. Okay, heat shielding. Concrete. I make it there's some of like the reinforced concrete so I think it looks better on the floor. We'll be trying to plaster as much of that eventually wherever I can. Green motors. Right. I will make all four. We don't quite need that right now. But I will make all four because we will eventually need it. Don't even know what we're missing for the next one. That's some pipe. Uh Grab some pipe and make a couple more, just so we've got them. Two more? Yeah. I'm going to need a lot more chests, because the uh, delivery kind of chest requires it, and we're going to need more for the capsules as well. Double check that. Oh, you don't require chests, but these guys do. 250. I think that'll be enough. It's a tiny bit overkill, but I think that'll be enough. Okie dokie then. Let's sort something out with these. Uh, so, I'm going to do Uh, something like this. I do need power, as we can see. There we go. Uh, so we can choose what they're sending. Uh, so. You're going to send lubricant barrels. You're going to send water barrels. Uh, 
And then if I do the deets. And uh, that one. The power. No, with the power. Thank you. And then, oh, I need to unload you. Right, so I haven't selected the destination yet. But we will eventually go and do this one. But we, because we don't have any, um, we don't have the chests. Don't have any of these yet. There, there's not much point just yet. Okay, let's uh, well, let's go and get some water barreled up. We do it from here. <laughs> 